Alrighty, folks. Uh, so I asked if you'd like to see another Arnie video, and you said yes. So here we are. Oh, look at this happy boy. Well now, how about that intro? Did you guys like that one? I made it just a little bit ago. Uh, I might get rid of that stuff with the blood, but you know, the the main point of that intro is just to be like parts of my uh, life, I guess. Like you saw the fish I caught and um, uh. I don't know, the blood, you know, just every part of my life. Here's a big boy. Here we go, and, oh, hey, hey, crazy, hey, let me in. Well, he's free. Hello. How are you today? Ah, I'm being attacked by a dog. Hello, yes. don't jump up me. Dog. I'm holding a camera, I'm trying to film. Move. We're gonna shake dogs. Move. I need to hey, I'm trying to film my video, buddy. I think this crazy dog knows that uh, he's, he's now a movie star. Uh, smile for the camera. He's learned a few tricks since the last video we made. Uh, so that's nice. He's learned to high five and how to shake. Ah! Oh, goodness gracious. This dude. Um, he's always hyper in the mornings. <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, he wants to come here. Um, so he's learned like high five and sit and shake. Um, I taught him high five and shake. <laughs> he knows stay, he knows come. Now, he doesn't always obey those rules, because sometimes he gets a little mischievous, but he knows how to do them. Smile. Jeez. Uh, a little race between Lincoln, my brother, and Arnie. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a race around the house. Uh, we got to get Arnie in the right position, though, so I got to... Alright, come here. Come on. How many sit. boots? Sit. sit. He's Arnie, pretty sit. much faster Good. than Stay. Alright, stay. The naughty little dude just chilling on the pillow. Well, he was chewing on it. Oh, there he goes again. Yeah, he likes our pillows out here. Luckily, we don't really use them. Lincoln's going to uh, film the race for us. He's pumped. <laughs> um, he's going to film the race for us. Uh, me versus Arnie, I suppose. Uh, we're just gonna go around the house, I guess. We're gonna go around the house, and, uh, he likes to race, so he doesn't chase you, he just runs past you. He likes racing. Never works. Honey, if you win this race, you get your throw back. Yeah, he doesn't really look like he's into he's interested in running right now, so. Hmm. He's well in the so Can I see your paws? Can I see your <gasps> paws? Can I see your paws? Look how big those paws are. And he's only a puppy. He's still just a puppy. I mean he's getting out of his puppy phases, but look at the paw. I mean that's the size of my hand. Almost. A little small, but about the size of my hand. Dude, he likes to uh eat acorns. Just randomly, hello. Um, he likes to just eat his acorns, um, so, you know, whenever he finds an acorn, he'll just chow down. Thankfully, acorns are not, uh, poisonous to this dog. I don't know about other types of dogs, but not to the Bernese Mountain Dog, at least. What are you doing? We don't really want him to eat a bunch of, uh, acorns, but since it's okay for him to eat them, sometimes we'll feed him one. <laughs> he just chows down on his acorn. Alrighty, let the race begin. Alrighty, boy. Sit. 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 Stay right there. Stay. Sit. 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 Alrighty, Lincoln. You tell us when to go. Three, two, one, go!
I'm claiming Arnie the winner. He was lit. So, uh, Lincoln is going to race Arnie. Yeah. <laughs> I think he fell out of racing. <laughs> um, so, yeah, he's going to race Arnie. Um, first one to cross this hose right here is the winner. And uh, we can put that in slow motion so that'll look pretty cool probably. Um, uh, especially if it's a close race that'll make it even cooler to watch I think. I don't know about you guys but I've always loved to uh, watch slow motion stuff um, or just like do something and I put it in slow motion. I always thought that stuff in slow motion looks really cool so yeah. Races begin. On your marks, get set, and go! Uh, he does not seem very encouraged. Go on over to the hose. Zoom. Let's, uh, let's try that again, shall we? He likes to just drink out of this thing. I mean, it's not poisonous, it's just water, so, you know, he hasn't died yet. There's Arnie. Right, you uh, ready? Three, two, one. <coughs> hey, Arnie. Hey, Arnie. Want to say hi to the camera? There you go. All right. Three, two, one. Go! Ooh! Now there's a close race. That was close. Oh, of course. My job well done. Good. That was a good race, huh? <laughs> that actually looked pretty funny. <laughs> You're so good. What are you doing? What are you doing? He oh, just wants right. to say good race. You are a professional. Oh, okay. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hey. It was close. I hey. think you got there first. But I don't... I think I but you, down to you it. got there first, but... Hey. Only hey. just came up out of nowhere and crossed the line at, like, the exact same time as you. Well, here you go, buddy. Crazy? Ah! Yeah, bit my butt. Hey, Ernie, what do you want to say to the viewers? Art. Would he you like to show how professional you are? Nope. There you go. Yes, it was a job well done. It was a job well done. What? What would you like to say to the viewers before Lincoln hits inside? Okay. Um, That's a good thing to say, Arnie. I'm sure they'll appreciate that. But hey, we're not done yet with this video, so only Link is done. He's going inside. I'm not even a YouTuber. He just wants to go eat some sugar. Mm, what? No. Well, technically, you have a YouTube channel. I ate breakfast. Well, yeah, but it was only so I could post things on different things. <laughs> but she didn't even put any videos up on anything, so. Alright, well, say Arnie. bye, Arnie. At least to me. Yeah. Arnie, say bye to Lincoln. Okay, bye. My sister Eden is now out to take care of the dog. She's the dog taker person this morning. I know. The garage has been opened up. Oh, don't eat the acorns. You have too many acorns. Hmm. You know what I should do? I should make some acorn flour. Oh, wow. This color's really showing here. Cool. 
You know, while I'm at it, I may as well introduce you to my other pets. Whoa, wow. I didn't even ask you to sit, you crazy boy. You're a good, good boy. And I didn't ask you to chew on my hand, but you chewed on my hand anyway, so. Not exactly what I was hoping for, but, you know. Let's see if I can find some other cats in this garage. We have three other cats in here. I don't know where they are. I probably have to go find them. Um, but we have three other cats. Um, we've gone through a lot of cats. Sadly. Oh, there's one. I found him. He's way up there on a the shelf. Oh, he's up sitting on the uh, net, which is in the trash bag, so we don't just store trash on our shelves. It's, it's a net. So if I can get it. Well, there's the net. And there's the cat. He sees the dog. He's pretty chill. This is Pippin. Um, he's the nicest cat, I'd say. He doesn't mind being held. He loves being held. He loves to be pet. Um, he's probably the nicest cat we have. He doesn't even care how you hold him. He can be held in different ways. And he hardly ever will jump out of your arms while you're holding him. He looks like he's giving the camera a death, death stare, but he's he's a nice dude. Um, so, yeah, that's cat number one. Probably the nicest cat. Number two is going to be a little harder to find because she's much smaller. She's black, and she's just always off on an adventure somewhere in the yard. Sometimes she probably goes out of the, uh... Dang, Arnie. Ew. Oh, <laughs> sometimes she, uh goes away, but she's always, she always comes back. Um, she's not a huge people person. She doesn't really like being held. You can hold her for, like, two seconds. I got a scar on my eyelid, because I picked her up once, but the first thing she did was poke her claw through my eyelid, which was not fun. Um, yeah. Whoa! Uh, here we are. The house of cat number two. This is our playhouse, um, which we have turned into a little house for our other cat. Named Shirley. Hello. She's much nicer than uh, the small black cat we call Booger. Her real name is Sugar, but she's a black cat, which confuses me. Hello, kitty. How are you today? She doesn't really like being held. She's 11 years old. She's older than Lincoln. So, yeah. Hmm. Um, yeah. She's a very nice cat. She hates Pippin and uh, Sugar, which I just call her Booger. She hates Pippin and Booger, um, so that's why she lives in this playhouse all alone. She's got a heat lamp for the cold days. Um, oh, here she goes. She'll hop up. Oh, hello. She likes to hop up on me sometimes, so, like, see if I can get her to do it. If you get the pat on your chest. Not right now, of course. Here you go. There she goes. She'll hop up on your chest. Not like full on your chest, but just her front paws. She's pretty cute. I like it. She, she is a uh, very lovable cat. She doesn't really like being held. I mean, you can hold her. I don't because she's so old. But she's still a pretty kitty. Are you a pretty kitty? Yes. As you can see um, on her... Right, let's see if I can get her. She's, yeah, she's gotten in a few fights with the other cats, which is why she's, her ear's a little nipped, um, right on the tip, if you can see. I'll have to put that in, like, slow motion or something. And also, ugh, she keeps bumping the camera. Um, oh, shit. Oh, hello. Um, she's got a big, like, wound on her head right there. Um, so, assuming that's from the other cats... Sometimes if I don't close the door at night soon enough, um, a possum will come in and, uh, eat all her food. She doesn't even mind the possum, though. I think, I think she has a secret crush on that possum. I think the possum has a crush on her. Um, I think they're actually dating Shirley and the possum. So, yeah, that's interesting. She'll just walk around on the floor while the, uh, possum is in here eating all her food, which I find to be rather disturbing. Um... Yep. She's a good kitty. Um, yeah. She's very nice, not super fond of being held. But she's a, she's a good cat. 
Anything you'd like to say to the viewers, Miss Shirley? Oh, yes, words of encouragement. That's always nice. Well, bye, Miss Shirley. I'm gonna get the irony in there. Ooh. It's a dog and a person. I, uh, I highly doubt that I'm going to be able to find the other cat, so I'm going to try the last thing possible. Cat treats. Oh, yeah. When I shake the bag, well, there's a dog who came. These are not for you. I'm sorry. But, oh, boy. When I shake the bag, uh, the cats hear it, and they know that it means treats. So they come. Except when there's a dog. Ugh. If I go away from the dog, I'm sorry, I need to try to find the other cats. Go back to Eden. She wants you. Go back to her. Oh, she's leaving you. She's going inside. You must go. Come on. You must go find your true love. Come on, crazy boy. There you go. Yes, go get her. No, I don't know. Go, Arnie, go. Come on. Okay, here. Let's go. There we go. Good boy. Wants a treat. Beast is back. This here has got to be, like, my favorite ever cat treat bag. Just because it's got, like, grumpy cat. Worst treat ever. No way. You know. Greatest treat ever. I love how on the front of their, uh treat bag they put worst treat ever uh i mean i guess it's this grumpy cat that will attract people to buy it but it's a little funny to me that they just put worst treat ever like grumpy cat is saying there obviously but i find it funny that they put that on their bag <laughs> see here when i shake the bag pippin i shook the bag when i was picking it up and pippin jumped see there he goes he's like oh yeah oh whoa he almost fell off hello Anything you'd like to say to the viewers at home? Give me a treat. I actually sort of taught Pippin to shake. Let me see if I can do it here. Oh, hello. Alright, crazy. Come on. Down you go. Me and the Pippin. We are the dynamic duo. What you doing? Oh. Come here, Pippin. Come on, if you want a treat, come on down. There he goes. Looky there. It's the booger cat. There she goes. Well, that's her. A lot smaller. Fat Mr. Pippin. Pippin, are you fat? Yes. Oh, she's meowing over there. Not a big people person, but sometimes she's nice. Uh, let's see if I can set this up. Uh, let me get a treat. So, uh, I kind of taught Mr. Pippin to shake here. Pippin, come on. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. All right. Mr. Pippin, can you shake? It's the cat version of shake, because cats don't really want you to grab their paws and shake. No. But if you put your hand above his head, he'll kind of reach for it, which is cute. Um, see if Booger wants one. Oh, she sees it's munching on something. She might want one. There you go. Oops. There you go. He likes these treats. He doesn't even chew them. That's the thing that scares me. They're, I mean, they're not that big, but they're like... It's like a little mouthful. It's like if you put, like, two frosted mini wheats in your mouth at once and swallowed them whole. That's kind of what it's like, I'm assuming. I mean, cats don't really have big mouths. Oh, come back, cat. <laughs> it's just waiting for more. There you go. Funny, because it says, like, when the cats chew on these, they it removes, like, plaque and stuff from their teeth. So, like, okay, that's great, but not so much for Pippin, because he just doesn't even chew on it. Oh, there was a crunch. If we listen closely. Well, now the booger's crunching on her food over here. Let me go find her. Whoa, it's messy back here. Whew. I need to clean up. Hello. Hi, dear. Now oh, she's happy. Would you like a treat? Oh, I should get you guys some food. There you go. Do you want a treat? Oh, I thought she ate that. Yeah, she doesn't really like the treats. Mm. Bum, bum, bum. 
Yep. Okay, well, I'll take care of that. Not much water. We keep our cat and dog food in a trash can. Oh, it's coming. Jumpers coming. The cats are freaking out. They're like, oh no. UPS. Mm. Doesn't look like anything. Keep our uh, cat food and dog food in the trash cans. Here's cat food. Scooper. Looks like the scooper's gotta be in a dog food. Hmm. Uh-huh. Eat kitties their food for the day. <laughs> Looks like a lot, but it's not actually that much. That's enough food for like a week. Thankfully, they don't eat that all. Okay. That's probably a good thing. Bloop. Alrighty. That's finished up. You know, today's cat day for me, so. Actually, yeah. Uh, yeah, today's cat day for me, so. Taking care of the cats, I guess. Pretty nifty little setup right here where you can like attach a bike onto these two. Uh, you can attach a bike onto these things and then what this. Oops. Um, it's tough with one hand. And then you can just pull on this thing. You just pull on this rope and it goes up and stuff. And you can also let them down. Ooh, pretty snazzy. So you can just. Haul a bike up to the ceiling if you need to. I guess that works. Looks really fat and zoomed up. Alright, anyway, mine. This kid here loves water, so, but she won't drink it unless it's running, so. I mean, she'll. What she does is it's kind of funny. She, um. She sticks her paw into this dish here, and then she will, like, wiggle her paw around so the water's kind of moving, and then she'll drink it. So sometimes if you just go up to her, and then, or if you just go up to the water bowl and stick your finger in it and make the water start moving, it will, uh, she'll come up and drink it. Hello. Hello. Going to the house. Whoa, that's some salt. That's a lot of leaves. Mm. We have arrived. Boop. Well, I guess if I do that thing where I make the water start moving, since there's a dog in here, that won't work very well. Go out. Be gone. I still love you. You want a treat? I have a treat. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Hmm. That's my okay. Go find your love. Where's my sister? Hmm. Find the sister. I have no clue where she actually went. Hmm. What are you eating? What are you eating? Look up at me with those innocent little eyes. Oh, oh, okay, well, I'm gonna steal it from my hand instead, okay. Go to Eden, not me, I'm trying to find a cat. Silly. I love how this video is supposed to be about the, uh, dog, but I'm, like, putting a bunch of cats in it. Oh, well, there's Pippin sitting on the lawnmower. Hello. The dog hath found it. Well, I need to zoom out. The dog found Pippin. Thankfully, Pippin's kind of okay with him. Not a huge fan of him, but he'll... He, he'll be okay with him for a little bit. Here you go, Pippin. Dog. Pippin. Pippin. Dog. Dun, 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 dun. Look what I got. Oh, boy. Now, I shall just, uh, include video footage of the dog. I'm being attacked by a rogue dog. <laughs> Stop chewing on my fingers. Look, I have video footage. Video evidence. Naughty, naughty. Oh my. Luckily, I have a pain tolerance. A good one, too. Stop chewing on my fingers. Stop it!
Let me get you a chew toy. Ah! Let me let's find you my my chew toy. I don't need a chew toy. I need to go get you one of your chew toys. Ugh. If I can get out. Ah, he's back in. Hello, mate. No, don't lick my camera. Alrighty, well, he's a little bit calmer right now, so, uh, ah! uh oh. Ah, he's back again. Oh boy. Hello. Hello. Why are you chewing on me? Be positive, Miles. Be positive. No! Well, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you aren't already a subscriber, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe. Uh, check out my other videos, uh, like the, uh, other Arnie one. Oh, he's stepping on me. He's like 70 pounds. Ugh. Ah. No, no, no. my camera. You're not messing all up. You're not messing my camera up. Anyway, the, 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 yeah. Oh, shoot. Hi. Hurry, stop hitting my camera. Okay, uh, see you guys in the next one. Talk to you then.